Scientific Research Department. A crucial part of the Kevale Dham, which really placed it on the international map, is the Scientific Research Department. <laughs> अब लोग पुराने धर्म से हमारे दादा परदादा कह रहे हैं इसलिए करना ये मानने वाले नहीं लोगों के श्रद्धा नहीं रहे तो आधुनिक विज्ञान के दृष्टि से हमें योग की उपयुक्तता और महत्ता को लोगों को बताना होगा और तभी लोग इसका स्वीकार करेंगे in this scientific research department, we have physiology section, psychology section, radiology section, then neuropsychology, biochemistry, physical education. In psychology section, you will be seeing various experiments. The constant gazing towards a point, towards a light, and when tears come out, at that time, we can enter into the subconscious level of our mind, and at that time, we can expose what we are there inside of our mind. If you have the psychological stress, tension, anxiety, it affects our physiological organs. And that is, to some extent, people they know. And this experiment, you can see here, that is about this, uh, 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 your stomach. How it is upset when a person is psychologically stressed. And if we give meditation or dhyana, we can see that within 10 minutes, it has uh, our stomach, upset condition of our stomach, stomach it becomes uh, normal. We are doing research work how yoga helps uh, to improve your eye-hand coordination. Can yoga help in that way? So we have experiments and we could see that yoga helps to improve the eye-hand coordination of the person. In the physiology section we have done some experiment and we could find that if a person is doing yoga or asana in a relaxed way so his physiological functionings are different and conducive for your health. Whereas if you practice it just like exercise, isometrically or isotonically, your impact is different. Now if a heart patient is doing that exercise or that asana, like exercise, positively he will be getting heart problem or intensity of suffering will be more. After yoga practices, the blood sugar level in diabetes, it has come down. The asthmatic patients, they are relieved when they are practicing yoga. We have presented this in international conference and we have got first prize for that. So similarly, in physical education section, we have done research work so far as health and fitness is concerned. So for health and fitness, nowadays the people, they are so aware of that they are going to gym, they are practicing exercises and they are keeping themselves fit. And they are spending lots of money for that. Whereas yoga, it can be practiced in simply six feet by six feet area inside the room and there is no need of money. So without that, you can improve or you can at least maintain your physical fitness level to live uh, fit in this world.